Prenatal visit. Purpose. Establish a baseline of present health. Determine the gestational age of the fetus. Monitor fetal development and maternal well-being. Identify women at risk for complications. Minimize the risk of possible complications by anticipating and preventing problems before they occur. Provide time for education about pregnancy, lactation, and you. Well, good morning, ma'am. I am Nina Valer Holanda Icaen, your student nurse for today. So I am here for your prenatal visit. Prepare the materials needed. Let the client sit comfortably facing to the nurse on the right side of the table. Simultaneously take vital signs of the client, blood pressure, temperature, pulse rate, and respiratory rate. getting your vital signs, um, uh, I will be instructing you to do the green catch green specimen for your urinalysis. So first is ako dure, itanganan sa kiki. And then, wala ka sa CR, then wash your hands first. After that, um, I will instruct you na you will clean your genitals with wipes. So, I have here three. So, ang um, una ni mga buhaton is sa imong left side, um, wipe it with wipes um, from front to back and then discard. And then, kukuha ka another wipes. Then, sa imong na pong right side, wipe it from right out uh, from front to back and then discard again. And then, the last one is um, sa middle. Then, wipe it again sa gitan sa front then back then discard after that um you squat um sit ka sa ball in a squat position and then mag um open ka sa lid ani and then um ayaw kapti ang lid because kana para dili siya mukotan then once makaihi ng ganika, ayaw ibutang ang ihi sa pinak ang pinakauna nga ning gawas na ihi. So, mga middle sa middle part. Ihi. After that, ayaw lang siya i-full. Half full lang ang ibutang ni mo. Then, after mabut na na ni mo siya, pwede na ka mangihi o tuloy sa bowl. Then, after that, um, close ni mo ang lid sa container. Um, uh, make sure na dilim ni mo kapatid ng lid to prevent contamination. Then, after that, wash your hands. And then, ibutang na na, after ni mo pag-ihi, ibutang na ni mo siya sa specific na butangan sa gawas. So, get to mo, ma'am. So, um, akong ipabalik kung ang instruction sa inyo kung nag-gets ka ng mga kong instructions. Ipabalik kung mag na ako.
dilin ako kung ang captain to prevent contamination. May mga orta. Kaya nang dilip po, ipuno kaayo ang pagdutang cup full lang. Ano. Then, after the anak, eh, ito yung isa yung mas. Don't forget nga, maging ka sa ipong genitals before ka mag-hit. So, that's it. Uh, so, can you please lay down? Getting the fundic height, then perform Leopold's maneuver. Perform the first maneuver fundal grip. Stand at the foot of the client, facing her, and place both hands flat on her abdomen. Palpate the superior surface of the fundus, determine consistency, shape, and mobility. Perform the second maneuver umbilical grip. Face the client and place the palm of each hand on either side of the abdomen. Palpate the sides of the uterus, hold the left hand stationary on the left side of the uterus, while the right hand palpates the opposite side of the uterus from top to bottom. Then hold the right hand steady and repeat palpation using the left hand on the left side. Perform the third maneuver pollux grip. Gently grasp the lower portion of the abdomen just above the synthesis pubis between the thumb and index finger and try to press the thumb and finger together. Perform the fourth maneuver pelvic grip. Place fingers on both sides of the uterus approximately 2 inches above the inguinal ligaments, pressing downward and inward in the direction of the birth canal and allow fingers to be carried downward. Auscultating the fetal heart rate. Obtain blood specimen for blood count. Document the findings and do aftercare.